More than 40,000 people will run in the Dick's Sporting Goods Pittsburgh Marathon when it takes off right here on Liberty Avenue on May 7th. That includes some refugee children who are running for an opportunity in life. They're running for a cause. It's happiness. 11-year-old Namita Karel, 16-year-old Bandana Fuyal, and 11-year-old Binsa Batari once lived in refugee camps. Their families are from Bhutan. It is a Buddhist kingdom at the edge of the Himalayas, bordering India. But they all settled in refugee camps in Nepal and then came to the United States. Um, because my parents want to give me and my brothers, I have a twin brother and a big brother, to get us good education. Here we get like water in our houses where in Nepal we'd have to go stand in like a long line and like wait for like hours to just to get water. When I came here, like everything was different. Like I actually knew how the outside world was and like what I was missing. The girls and these other kids are in a recreational program put on by the South Hills Interfaith Movement. The organization helps residents and refugees meet basic needs. Right now, they're getting the kids ready to run the Pittsburgh Marathon 5K. Oh, it's been a lot of fun. We, you know, we started with probably three or four kids that wanted to do it, and we've grown to 30. These kids are not athletes, but it doesn't matter. I get to get outside to get some exercise, not just sit inside my house, because I'm not a very good runner, but this helps me kind of get out of my comfort zone a little and run more. To be with, like, to meet new people, because there's so many people there, and, like, just to be around new people and get some exercise for myself. Because it's my first time running, and then I think it will be, like, really good, and it's like a flat surface. So these girls are using the Pittsburgh Three Rivers Marathon to run from their refugee past and into a bright future in Pittsburgh. Sheldon Ingram, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.